Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you some easy steps to help you configure your dual monitors on your Mac. Now there's not very many options that uh, Mac OS X has for dual monitor setup, but let's go ahead and take a look at them. So you want to go into system preferences and now I'm already assuming that you've connected your monitors together and they're both working uh, well. Then you just go to displays. And um, if you've gotten this far, you should see another system preference window on the other monitor. So I'll go ahead and bring that over here so you can see it. So this is the monitor on the left that I have. And the monitor on the right is my cinema display. Now we can go ahead and do a bunch of things here. And actually we can go ahead and check out uh, this as well. And as you can tell, it has a secondary display. So you can set the wallpaper up and everything. So that's how you do wallpaper and a screen saver with the dual monitors. But let's go ahead and go back to displays. And as you can tell right here, we can adjust the brightness because uh, there's actually no like universal switch where you can say uh, match my brightness. There might be some cool application that does that. If not, then that would probably be a great investment for somebody. And um, so, yep, there's brightness right there. And you can also change the resolution and everything. You can calibrate the color. But if you want to rearrange things, say you want to move this one to the left part of your desk, then the easy thing to do is go to arrangement and simply move it like this. As you can tell, I'm not sure with the screen recorder, but the outsides of my monitor are turning red for both of the monitors. and that goes that goes ahead and allows you to move the monitors around so um, you can imagine this as your setup right now if I move my cursor from here to here that's how the screens will work in uh, real life while you're doing that with your cursor if you want it to be the other direction then all you have to do is switch it over here but if you want to have the dock and the main source basically is this little toolbar up here. It's very small. You have to grab it up there. As you can tell, you can move it from your main monitor to the secondary monitor if you want to switch things up. And you can also do that. And you can also set this thing above if your monitors uh, mounted up there above the computer. You can do it below and you can do it basically wherever you want. Um, another thing is that if your if your secondary display is smaller than your big display, uh, when you're moving your mouse cursor over, as you can tell right here, um, it's not going over, and that's exactly how I want it because this is exactly how my monitor is sitting. It's sitting slightly slower, or slightly lower than my iMac monitor. If my monitor was bigger, I could do it like this. Or I could even move it like this and you could really do it however you want. If you only want like just a portion of the secondary monitor to um, go over with the cursor. So now you can tell this entire section doesn't work. It doesn't go over to the other monitor because I would have to do this tiny little space up there. And there you go. So you can also do um, airplay mirroring if you want. You can do a bunch of different things. You can mirror both of the displays. Um, so they're showing one thing if you want to turn your monitor around and share your class for instance And you can also do that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching